Hello everyone and welcome back to this. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and start this. Forgotten Rivalry. Also, I'm just now noticing that there are three digits in like the the like count for the um for the stage. I really hope there aren't over a hundred levels in this thing. It's been about a decade since we last lived over here. Can't believe it's I've uh, gone this long without visiting. No chance you know this person, then. I heard you'd be back in this area, Ar um, Arcturus. No, dear, I really have no idea who he is. It's me, Santoros, your rival. You're better. Oh, you're that fellow who crashed our wedding. Right, I've seen you a few times, yes. But rivals, though? I'm sorry, but you're not there. I might be more uh, mostly retired, but I can tell you're not mad. You're no match. How dare you? I'll take you all down. Are you sure? You know you're almost head and toe when cursed in magic gear, right? Did you ever identify half of what you put on? I... Some of these things aren't even supposed to go in the same item slot, so they're, um... They're doing nothing for you like that. Please, just go home. You don't want this. I don't have to take this from you. He has some nice weapons, but his armor and accessories are clearly cursed. Let's make this quick fight. Or fight quick. Wait, I didn't heal. Um, oh no. Also, your, uh... Your MP isn't- or your HP isn't showing. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I... His scarf was cursed to suffocate him as he fought. <laughs> Guess this was the first fight he wore uh, He wore it for. Probably could tell it was a, ma a magic and hoped it was good. Unfortunate. Surely, well... These weapons are nice, at least. Uh, Chidi, want this bow? Should we really be taking these off of him? If it wasn't us, he could have actually done some lasting damage with those weapons. Better for us to take them. Besides, your birthday is coming up, and it's important for a man to get a proper weapon as a gift for his 20th birthday. I'll do some maintenance to get it prepared for you. I... thanks, uncle. Where is... Where is Chidi or whatever his name was? I'm gonna scroll. Oh, there you are. Okay, no, it it doesn't gain like a like a new weapon for him. <laughs> a close shave. There's an old friend I want to stop and see real quick. It won't take long. Also, there's something I want to show you guys real quick. Okay, so this is the game page up here. On itch.io, at the very top of the page, it typically says, like, you own this game or, like, you own whatever the name of the game is. Uh, for this one, though, it says, you own this excessive joke. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> like, they're really going all in with that. <laughs> Like, I, I can respect a joke game that, like, doesn't take itself seriously at all. <laughs> been a long time, huh, partner? No way. Been too long since you've been around. Hard to see you in the crowd. 
This is Jer uh, Jeremiah, my old business partner. We opened the shop ages ago. You still running it? Yeah, though uh, Junior does uh, does most of the work now. My hands are too stiff nowadays. Say, mind helping me out? Junior has gotten a little um cocky. Mind showing him up a bit? Knock him down a peg? Sure, I'll cut him down to size. Great, come on in. We have two customers come in a bit ago. That'd be great for this. I think we'll hold it right out from uh, front here. Uh, though to fit all of you in the shop, wait just a bit. What? <coughs> That's a lot of hair. A hair situation. With that much, I can only wonder, to pay or not to pay? I think uh, they're just a hair above doing that for the for this sort of event. Well, as long as we're a, we're a cut above, please just stop. Put uh, putting up with the, with this um, at home is one thing, but not while we're in public. So, ready to get serious? Thank you, Creative Cloud. <laughs> Who am I competing against? That be me. Which uh, which one's mine? Uh, this guy. Why aren't you in front? Oh, you want a you want a head start, kid. See, this is my crew. Wait, all of them? We never. No time to back out now. Start. Our customer, their customer. We'll need to cut our customer's hair faster than him. <laughs> Slashing damage is the only way to get the job done. Try and do some, uh, to do so on their customer won't work. And we can't just beat up Junior there. Though I'm not saying I'm above sabotage. Certain fights will have targets that are only affected by a single element type. Characters that are best for this will be marked with exclamation. Use only slashing damage on our customer. Oh, that's that's nice giving you giving like the the player that. Slashing attacks feel like they would be mostly physical. Okay, so this is like literally a damage race. Like you just have to out damage this guy. Again, this is a really like creative concept for a fight. I mean, at the end of the day, we are still just like restoring. Wow, how many? How do I really not have that many guys with slashing damage? Wind damage. Ooh. Oh, you got a critical hit there. Uh... Okay. <laughs> yeah, so you take more damage from slashing damage now. You keep getting critical hit. You keep getting critical hits. I think we're ahead though. Right about the halfway mark, keep cutting. So are you. He's about at the halfway point. We need to pick up the pace. Oh, 
Oh my god, stop getting critical hits. I'm starting to think this might actually come be up to luck. Like... <laughs> We're doing like a little under four, a little over 400 damage each attack, though. I, oh god, okay, yeah, we got this. I did not catch that. Oh, there we go! <laughs> well, that was a hard, um... That was hardly fair. <laughs> Dude, there were like five guys in our party that could actually do stuff. And now you understand why kids like you can't compete with us. We're not above playing dirty. That's right. That's a lesson you're trying to teach me. Try to... to not play fair? And to not expect your opponent to. People take advantage all the time. Whether it's because they know somebody can fix an event, an event, or pay somebody off, or the system is just set up in their benefit. Things like this happen all the time. I just wanted to learn in a... In a in a setting where there weren't any stakes. I get it. Now then, take these. Not as thanks, but they're yours, um, anyway. And honestly, don't need them laying around here. We need to finish cutting the other fellas here. Right, I appreciate it. Take care of yourselves. Flimsy scissors. Deal slashing damage to one, to one target. Desertion. Seems like something's going uh, going on over there. Let's investigate. What's all the commotion? Oh, my name is Haron, and I'm a guard for the nearby town. These rioters have started attacking me and the other local guards for no reason. Oh, that's a nice military uniform from the neighboring country. 32 years and they still haven't changed the captain's uniform. Look, I'll pay you all uh, you all to defend me, okay? Is that what you want? He had not he, he had to say that. If payment's your game, then I'm not I'm not then I'm your dame. Mo, um Mojisolo's world's strongest mercenary at your service. I can't allow this. Please just go along with this. Not for too long, okay? Anz, you understand, yeah? I got it. Just make sure to fight and make it look good. I know what you're doing. Let's just go uh, go along with this for a bit, Ark. What do you think? Yeah, I've been adventuring uh, buddies of, with uh, Majgan almost as long as uh, your mother. I trust her. All right, I'll get started when you pay up. All right, let's make this a good one. Mama needs to get paid. I really can't say I agree with. If you want to help play along, Mogjan, help me for a sec. I'm only good enough to leave one uh, one body behind. Uh, what? Hold on, I can do this. Didn't I do this earlier? Oh no, that's for like targeting. Also, did I just get a new party member from that? <laughs> I did not need to do that. Which character do I need? Oh, you! Wait, that counts as one enemy? Okay.
Hot Run, I'm going to need more money. Sure, hey. Okay. <laughs> Where is Moji Sola in this? Oh. Oh, you got a P next to you. Oh, okay, there we go. I can only do that once. How much health do you guys have? Oh, oh really? Oh, okay. Huh, okay, I wasn't really feeling that fight, to be honest. <laughs> What's the problem? Out of cash already? I already gave you what I have. That should be more than plenty. She said she's the world's strongest mercenary, it's true, honest. But she's also the, world, uh, the world's most expensive mercenary. You're, not, you're no better than... Than what, a small guerrilla military force? Come on, how can you be so senseless and stupid? By the way, I got some neat things from that, um, from that militia. Nice bunch of dudes. I'll show you as we leave. Wait, please. Molotov cocktails. <laughs> My god. Huh, that was a weird fight. Um... 
I was expecting that to, to be like a group hit skill or a group hit item. Since we're here, field trip. Some of our less than living members of the group have gotten a bit overheated during our travels. This will be a good chance for my students to learn how to help these sorts of allies. After checking in on everyone, can you come back to me and let me know what, they're, what uh, they've learned? Oh, how big is this place? So you're her cousin, Josephine. Yes, though she's not a vampire, I went on an adventure and drank someone's, uh, something I thought was, was wine. Apparently it was vampire blood. I didn't die, not truly at least. Is it hard to deal with things like sunlight and garlic? No, my aunt gave me a relic to help me with such things. Tough, is, uh, tough to talk with fangs, though. Yes, very. It makes some words tough. I need to grind them down again. I have a barrier set up so no one can get lost out here. It's a wide area, though, so remember that this is about the center point of it. You could just make a better map, <laughs> like... Not sure why the teacher wanted, like, an easier map to traverse around. Want me to attend to you. I mean, you're still alive, and it's not like we can talk anyway. Well, sure, I get that you're technically... you technically died a few times, but you're not undead or anything. You can enter churches and stuff just fine. Okay, since they don't acknowledge you for your beliefs, maybe they, there are consequences. But not, like, bursting into flames, or... Don't look at me like that. I can't remember all the things you've literally died. All the times you've died. I just remember the stories of Man uh, Manvo would tell us at the cafe. I'm really not sure what to tell Teach that I've uh, that I learned from this. Wait, so you took over the world um, a millennia ago? Yes, and then I got bored and started doing other things, like becoming a dancer. Why not? You know, stay in charge. Right, like, I don't get what, um, why you'd give it up. Once I had everything, there was nothing to strive for, so I started questioning what I was doing, and whether I even wanted it. Turns out I didn't, ruling isn't fun, and I wanted fun. I learned a bunch of instruments, took up various arts and crafts, and eventually settled on dancing. So how come our teacher wanted us to talk to you? You're undead. I was made by an evil being through creating a fake soul that was put into a body comprised of 13 different body parts. Huh. Wild. Yeah, it's really not that interesting. I, um, uh, have a look. I'm testing a out a new bell, listen. Hear that sound? No, why? I do. It's not a noise that the living can hear. Since she's about halfway dead, she can hear it. Rude. What's it sound like? Annoying. Do I know anything... Do I know anyone it'd be fun to annoy with this? I think that's everyone. Okay, what'd you learn? Not a thing, huh? Disappointing. I guess I better prepare some extra work for them, then. Well, thanks for your help. Oh, that's it? Some of these aren't battles? Okay. A new rivalry. Oh dear, looks like we have trouble ahead. You have really good eyesight. I'm surprised at how well I can still see. Honestly, no magical enhancement enhancements or anything. So you're those people. This feels familiar. My name is Dorina, and I will t uh, take back what you stole from my father. Wait, who um who was your father? Santoros. Santoros had a kid. Val. Look, we were just all thinking. Enough. I shall take you all on. With that gear and attitude, the uh, the apple really didn't fall from far from the tree. <laughs> She's actually packing a lot of good magic gear. Right, she seems inexperienced, but let's play this safe.
honestly don't seem that bad so far. A couple characters have died. Wash? Whelm. That was not very strong. Alright, that worked. She vanished. Impressive. Yeah, I'm not seeing her anywhere. Uh, looks like she dropped a couple things once while escaping, though. A cr 
equipment receipts in Reckless Potion. Ooh. Wait, let's be honest with our item names. <laughs> A group like... <laughs> Meh. <laughs> I'm starting to, like, get more used to what the icons mean, too. Like, some of them are kind of creative. Huh, okay. The heat brings a plague. Hello, everyone. My name is Afra, and... You alright? Sorry, I'm always coming down with something. Anyway, I've been sent by the Dark Lord to... to... There's a cat around too, isn't there? <laughs> let's, uh, let's just do this. Ew, she has a really bad case of the flu. Everyone be sure to get some disinfectant. Please cover your mouth with your arms. Nothing grosser than handshakes with a sneeze on it. That's a good start. <laughs> Has the flu in suffering from allergies? Okay, so one of them made it so status ailments like positive ones don't work as much. I'm assuming the other one is just a poison. You get to do that a lot. Like, spam that a lot. Something that removes apathetism. We don't have sleepy though. I I'll, I'll I'll hold off on that. This fight doesn't honestly seem that bad.
Ooh, nice. Alright, cool. <laughs> There's a way across the desert that's through um, a portal in here. Why don't we just go across the desert? This is, a, is, that, is this actually faster? I'm not big on trusting portals. It'll take a lot of supplies and we're going through what we have fast enough. Also, much easier to get lost out there in the desert. Besides, this way has to, uh, we have to navigate through a structure. Isn't that your area of expertise, sis? I just want to get this over and done with as quickly as we can. Let's start looking around. Be careful in here. If we fight, we won't be able to use everyone with how narrow these corridors are. Does that mean there are random encounters in here? Wait, who's that? There's nothing else in here I can find. I guess I gotta talk to that person. The statue seems to be blocking the way forward. In this tight corridor, and with this weight, we can't move it. There's three spots on the base that look like they're, um... There were gems there. For a pyramid, I was expecting a more of a puzzle than that. Let's find the gems and come back. I'm starting to get worried that this place, like, loops vertically or something, but no, here's the end. What do these gems look like? I've, I haven't found any so far. Oh! No, that's a chicken. That might be what we need, though. Ah, oh, this is too big for its own good. <laughs> Rooster makes rooster noises. Are they communicating? I've seen this one before. Makes angry rooster noises. It doesn't seem like it's going well. Are we really about to fight a chicken? Oh, you can't sense its power. I'm sorry, what? This wasn't the original master of this tomb. He's strong, but also headstrong. I hope- I turned him into a chicken ages ago because I thought it was funny. He can't use magic in this form, but it looks like he's gotten used to this body. You can't be serious.
Oh. Dang cocky. <laughs> you serious? Belly dancing increase your attack. That works. We'll be taking that, but I'll come back to- uh, I'll come change you back later. Okay, so we gotta do like mini battles for these, I guess. sure if I like the stage. Like, it, it's... it's just a maze. Like, it's... There's the statue. That's a dead end. Would the right hand trick even work with this maze? It's like, it's one of those weird mazes where, like, everything is just spread out in a way, you know?
You're not necessarily finding an exit, but like everything is closed, so like. Hmm. There's the entrance. Oh, there, okay, okay. Oh, you surprised me. Just kidding, it sounds like a stampede in here of all of you. <laughs> We're looking for some gems. Have you seen any here? Hold on. You're, uh, Leary, the legendary thief, aren't you? I see my reputation precedes me. I have found a few things here, but I don't want to just hand them over. Shall we take them from you, then? I don't think that's a good idea, princess. Oh, that's a first from you. Now, don't be getting cold feet. I can't go all all out with how small this area is, though I can't fight... You can't fight me with, with things this way, either. She's really a big deal, huh? They say she's able to literally steal light. I don't know how useful that is in a fight, but being in a corridor like this is bad news. Okay, so you're big on status ailments. Yeah, let's do that.
Okay, that's a lot of damage. Okay, I think I'm gonna do, like, a super soldier kind of strat here, because, like, these random stat boosts are, like, really good. Don't hit Isabel. Okay, good. Oh, yes. Uh-oh. Skill evasion reduced. That's not that bad. Nice. You won fair and square, so here we go. We'll meet again so, uh, sometime soon, I'm sure. Okay, I was really hoping the game would, like, auto, like, move you to, to that area. <laughs> no, RPG Maker doesn't work that way. Oh, okay. I gotta find a way to you. You know, the really long party trail is actually, like, kind of helpful for, like... For, like, remembering which way you've already gone <laughs> in a short period of time. Here we are. This is a very annoying stage. You. Interesting, he's on the brink of undeath. I think he tried a similar ritual to your father, but didn't go quite as far with it. He doesn't seem like he's very aware, though. It looks like he, uh, there's a gem on his belt. Should I just take it? We may have to fight for it. Go, we must purge the undead where, um, where we, uh, where we can anyway. You know, these, uh, these faithless undead, not like you. I'll do what I can, but I'm not the best for this. We'll want light and life damage. I smell poison.
I... I cannot fall. What? Actually doesn't do that much less. Stay down already. Well, I did something. more damage than like some magic or some like magic he's presumably weak to. That, that fight kind of sucked, to be honest. <laughs> Fine, here. He seems pa uh, pacified. Should we let him live? Yes. Oh, now I gotta go back to the statue again. Frickin' heck. Uh...
Oh my fucking god, this stage is atrocious. Like... <laughs> remember correctly, it's like somewhat north of the entrance. Oh, there, there. Here, I'll set, uh, I'll set them in. Let's see. dares disturb there's quite a lot of you i am sadik the guardian of this realm's portal of the underworld we're heading to the underworld uh not two just through it's honestly pretty efficient this way efficient how the hold up let's take a sec you two have been there before and know the way right yes actually several times okay so let's just trust that this thing is the that this is the way to go fine I wonder why we've never um, encountered this guardian before, though. The stone uses, uh, used for him looks to be kind of different from the types he would find in this area. Not by much, but... When did you start guarding this area? I just remember that I was told to guard the spot when I woke up, and everything went dark. No chance you'd, uh, you'd, you'd just like to take a few steps back, huh? You seem nice, but sorry, I must guard this spot. He seems pretty durable, not sure if he'll win a, a drawn-out battle here. Then let's just take him down. Well said, let's give it our all. Is this another damage race fight? Eye lasers. Are you weak to social? <laughs> Thank you. 
I, I'm very surprised you took a lot of damage from that. <laughs> I got the impression that this is like a high defense rock guy, so like you wouldn't expect wind to work that well. You aren't finishing me off. Honestly, if you just take a few steps out of the way, that's all we need. Oh, sure. Okay, then. You can rematch him? <laughs> that guy seems nice. Like, <laughs> he's just doing his job. I can respect it. Well, here we are. Wow, okay, that stage, like, really sucked. I did not like that at all. Um, we're on to World 3, though. I will see you folks later. Thanks for watching.